Hey guys, the Monster here at the Monster Garage, and uh, I haven't talked to any of you in quite some time, mainly because I've been mostly dead for a couple months. Uh, I say that jokingly, but uh, there's a lot of truth to it. I've basically been very sick um, because of a liver transplant that went really well and then went really bad, um, and I had teams of nurses and doctors trying to keep me alive. And uh, they did it, so I'm here. And uh, I just want to thank everybody for their, the time they they spent in prayer for me, and uh, just the the outpouring of support uh, from friends, family, people I don't even know. Uh, it was just amazing, and it was uplifting, and it kept me going when uh, when times sometimes I just didn't want to go anymore. Um, I hit pain thresholds that. I never knew I could get through. Uh, they used to have a chart that was a 1 through a 10. I would uh, chart out, uh, in my mind, as a 16. A 10 was good to me. I got to where I actually liked pain. Um, I know that's kind of crazy and kind of weird, but uh, the pain made me feel alive. But I'm back back at it and uh, took this baby out today, the rocket, and took it for a ride. Basically, the nurses and the doctors all have limitations that they put on you. And there's a, there's a history of how soon you should go back to work, how soon you should, uh, you know, basically be functioning as a normal person. And uh, to normal people, I guess that's all right. But I feel like you don't need to limit yourself. You need to set goals. And I set my goals really high. And uh, I was able to achieve most all of them, uh, exceed a bunch of them. And I just want to encourage anybody that's going through this type of uh, trauma in their life. Uh, there's trauma for, for all involved, even the caregivers. You know, they, uh, they have to take a slice of their life out for you. And I uh, always remember the caregiver. But uh, for sure, Never be limited by somebody else telling you you can't do this or that. I was so discouraged one time when uh, my wife Joan read me some things on the internet about uh, not being able to drive. Oh, I went out and I hit a mailbox with my mirror. I guess I won't be able to drive anymore. And, and uh, there's so many people that limit themselves by other people. Set your own goal. You decide what you can do. Your body will tell you. Your mind will tell you too. I've learned I have limitations. I'm, uh, I'm fuzzy. Uh, when I say fuzzy, my brain is not 100%. Things that were natural to me, I'm having to relearn. Uh, wiring up things that used to be easy. Now I have to watch my own videos to figure out how to do it. Um, but that's not slowing me down. That's just pushing me forward. Your mind is a muscle and you have to exercise it. And uh, I've been doing my best to exercise it. I just want to give Thanks to all, and I want to give God the credit. Um, I got close to God, real close. Can't say I saw him, that I heard him, and I, I knew that he wasn't done with me yet. And that's why I'm here today. And just thank you all, and I just wanted to do an update, and you'll be seeing more of me uh, in the future. And uh, I guess that's it. Take care.